Thank you for buying this 21004 apparel display from Fixture Displays. In this short video, we're going to give you step-by-step -step instructions to put this together. This is the base. We have the center support tower panels and the panels which come with the sign holders on one side of the panel and the top hardware and shelf panels. If you have any questions, feel free to email us cs at fixturedisplays.com. First, you want to identify the base and put all the bolts or screws onto the holes. You can use a simple screwdriver or a light duty power drill to save some time. Now we're going to insert all the cams into the big holes. On the cam, there is a very small arrow. We're going to have a close up and make sure this arrow face out toward the opening of the hole on the edge. If it is not, uh, the assembly would not be as snug as it can be. Now we have prepared all the four support panels. We're going to join two together, make a sub-assembly, and then we'll join the two, two twos together, make the center tower. There are four holes that would be lined up to the four bolts and just like that. Now you can turn the cam clockwise and again make sure there's no gap or very little gap. Uh, if there is substantial gap, you want to make sure your cams are starting in the right position. Now you want to double check the, uh, the top level hole to the edge. The one that is uh, further or longer should face down at this stage. Uh, bottom line is you want to make sure the two, um, two units you are looking at right now have consistency consistency in that regard. Now the, we're going to interconnect the two sub-assemblies and there should be a snug fit be, before you fasten the cams. The cams are to be turned clockwise. Now we're going to ready uh, the end panels. The end panel, one side of those have acrylic sign holders that is covered with the protective film. You don't want to peel that off yet, but you could. You could, if you handle this with care, you can peel that off now, and you may encounter some difficulty peeling. Uh, if that occurs, you can use some rubbing alcohol to clean that off. Once we have all the four end panels in place, we're going to put the base onto the very top and then of course we're going to flip that. A couple of people would be good to have uh, to uh, do this next couple of steps, although one person uh, is uh, adequate to do so, but two people will just give you a little more. Um, safety. Now we have it flipped. We're going to do the same on the top, which should be a lot simpler because of the lighter weight. Fixture displays have a large selection of stock displays on our website www.fixturedisplays.com. Free, free to browse around and you can find many other products fit for your store or consumer products that fit your everyday needs. Now we're going to try to put a few shelves in. Again, the shelves are adjustable. You can pick your positions. Each tier is six inches apart. In this particular example, we're doing um, uh, 12 inch intervals. This would be a great display to display t-shirts, jeans, or even shoes. If you do need additional shelves, uh, feel free to contact us. We do not stock them, but we'd be happy to order them for you. Now we're peeling the protective films off. Again, if you have any difficulty, use rubbing alcohol. 
To insert graphics, you want to remove the screws, and then you can insert your graphics. The graphics is 8 inches wide, 49 inches long. You don't have to utilize the full length or height, uh, but do try to center it. And then you can fasten the screws back. We're going to give you some dimensions. It's 23 inches wide, 23 inches deep, and 57 inches tall. All right, the shelves, again, the graphics is 8 inches wide. And it is 49 inches tall. Between the shelf hole positions is 6 inches. And the width is 11 inches and 9 inches deep. The entire unit weighs about 94 pounds. If you like our product and or this video, we can really use a good review. Feel free to share uh, in your social network. And this is how it spins. It don't spin super fast uh, for uh, you don't really want uh, any merchandise to spin out, but does allow you to turn to allow customers to uh, view different angles. Thank you for shopping Fixture Displays.